Hi. New Chantel today. Oh my god. Mm. I I'm like that with him. Like I'm like one minute. I wanna fucking destroy him. Letting myself get to that anger, emotion to where I just wanna mm, destroy somebody. Mm -hmm. And then the next next minute I'm like in love, like I just obsessed. I don't know, like my feelings are fucked. Good like, morning! What's wrong with your old life with me? Like I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. Yes, I seen him again, so that like made me want to see him over and over and over again. I know. So we go back to her house. He convinced me to go back to her house and just ignore me. I sent him messages all fucking day. Natter, you're not gonna do this to me. You're not gonna do this to me, Natter. Is it because I can't have it? Oh my god. Mm. And she was like just laying on the bed ready. And I was just like, oh my god. <laughs> and I was so drunk and I like threw up right after. Like you should have seen the horrible shit I said to him. It was disgusting actually. Oh mamma mia. He even told me, you're gonna one day be in that in Didi's fucking bed with them. He was so fucking right. I went on the couch because I don't want to sleep in the bed with them because I'm fucking crowded and I felt sick. I went on the couch to sleep so I could go home. He came in and pulled me by the arm into the bedroom. Oh, mamma mia. Yesterday? I don't even want to talk about it. Actually, I will say, I didn't, I was not myself. What I did with Dee was, I'm not even putting her down. I'm just saying the whole experience fucked me up because like he knows how I feel. Oh my god. And I'm saying that because I don't feel right as a person being like that. Like, you deserve it. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it, plain cheeseburgers. I really don't want to talk. I really don't want to think about it. I don't want to think about it. I really, 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 really fucking traumatized. Like, I swear. Like, that fucked me up. And then for him to know how I feel, and then, like... Ugh. I felt like they were trying to, like, slowly, like, out themselves to me. And, like, make it okay. Like, he wants to keep the peace with everybody. Ugh. <laughs> to think that he never loved me is what hurts the most. <laughs> And you don't see any of it. And him and Dee Dee. And they act fucking normal. And make me look crazy. That's what fucking happens every time. Like I messaged Dee Dee and like I like just saying like, hey, you know, like, if you're gonna throw a blanket out, I get it. So maybe I can arrange to get it from you. And then he told me to come get my shit. Isn't this a surprise? I ended up driving them to Montreal. They're like, we're gonna pick up bottles of wine because Dee Dee drink. Oh. Ask her to show you behind her sink. She has like 800 fucking empty wine bottles. How happy was it? She doesn't sleep, she drinks wine all night. She must be in love with him and he's like fucking with her and using her now. You are liar. But then when we get to Montreal and shit went south, we kick him back up. So I wanted to get a hotel and I wanted to spend my birthday with him in a hotel. We were driving away and fucking Didi freaking call, calling, freaking out. I don't want no scraps. Come back, Nutter, come back, Nutter. She's like, I'm going to the hotel with Chantel. She's like, no, you're not. <laughs> why are you so, why are you so concerned? Like, are you fucking for real? Nightclub reason. And threatening to talk to your harem about it and drinking wine. So we go back to her house. He convinced me to go back to her house. This is ridiculous. I get drunk all night. Uh, I don't even want to talk about what fucking happened. I don't want to talk about it. I fucking hate him so much. <laughs> he fucking hides my phone from me all night. You don't talk. He got really drunk and she got all pissed because he like was supposed to go see her mom. <laughs> At the group home with her and she's like, Natter, you're not gonna do this to me. You're not gonna do this to me, Natter. <laughs> and then like they got in a big fight and she's like, you're not gonna talk to me like you talked to her. That night that I was there, he told me he loved me over and over. It's really destroying me. A little bit of a waste. The whole Dee Dee's like, what about my feelings? I'm gonna be up all night drinking wine. Oh, Charmula is so good. Go fucking play with your fucking vibrator, you stupid fucking idiot. You make yourself look bad. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. You fucking stay home then. I know why Delphine had a heart attack. Yeah, you gave it to her. You have no problem with me coming over. Fuck me! When it's convenient for you to get a fucking ride back to Montreal because you're complaining that you had to use all your money in Uber rides with Dee Dee. Straight up to the boy. Back to Gatineau. But then you won't go take a hotel room with me because Dee Dee's crying and threatening to tell your harem that you're with me. Yeah, fuck you. Shall I go leave? Fuck you, Dee. Fuck you, Natter. Fuck 
Fuck you, Hiram. Fuck you. I hate liars. You. Oh. <laughs>